I'm going to show you how to take a photo with OneNote and upload it. So firstly you need to get the OneNote app from the App Store and so download that and then when, once OneNote is open click on plus and then the camera and then take picture and then find the work you want to take the photo of and then click on done and then that's on the page and then you just go ahead and label it and now it's on your OneNote. Have you ever gone to open your class notebook and the content's not there? It looks like this. So, you know, you can't see your students, you can't see your teacher only section. Don't despair, it's there. Here's a quick uh, workaround that I found that will solve the problem for you. Click on the magnifying glass and click on the X and it's there. All there for you. Amazing. So if you go over here to this right hand side, you've got the individual pages. If you right click, see here we've got this option of distribute page. And we can select the folder uh, in each of the individual students' workspaces that it'll go to. And with one button we can distribute the page to everyone. Uh, another thing that's really helpful is to be able to review the student's work without having to open up every one of these um, individual folders. So class notebook and review student work uh, and you know select the folder you want to be looking in and then so we want to have a look because we've got students have done work in this folder here so we open this one up and here's all of our students work. We scroll down to see, see as you know it's, uh, it's bold so without having to open up individual students we can just click on that and we can scroll down, see the work that they've done and provide them with feedback and then move on to the next one. The thing is though that that requires the class notebook added. I'm going to show you how to download the class notebook um, app. Go to your, your waffle and go to your class notebook and then down the bottom of the page here, download the class notebook add-in. Uh, in the collaboration space, I've put a, a learning status page together. So when the students have completed each of the learning experiences or each of the lessons, I need to come and sign off in here. Now the way they do that is they find their name and the lesson. This needs to be in the desktop version of Class Notebook. And then they click on right click and right down the bottom there's their name, they click on that and it's their digital signature. No one else can do that for them and um, they can't fudge the time either. So uh, that's going to be my way of checking that the students have done their work. And, um, and then where I want to provide a response, I can obviously provide a, a written response. But as well as that I can insert and I can do a audio recording or a video recording. So click on audio and it's going to start recording straight away. Okay, purple monkey dishwasher, rhubarb, 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 and then the recording is there. Okay, purple monkey dishwasher. All right, so then we can do an audio recording or we can do a video recording. So insert, record video, and purple monkey dishwasher, rhubarb, 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 and we can stop that. So you can see it's, it's fairly low res, so it doesn't take up a lot of space, and you can put that straight into the OneNote.